それでは皆さん、We've talked about the main particles that we are going to introduce in chapter 3 up until now. Now I want to pause for just a moment and remind you how you can make some questions using those particles. So let's take a look. So if we want to ask what someone does, so for example, if I want to ask、um, what someone drinks with the verb to drink, what is our question word that means what? That's right, our question word is nani. So I want to ask the question with the word nani. So I'll ask, like, topic wa, location de, nani o, and then the verb. And to make it a question, we always need the particle ka. So, for example, kisaten, sumimasen, though this was the old word、um, in the old version of Genki. Now we have cafe. So, sorry about that. Cafe de nani o nomimas ka? Cafe de nani o nomimas ka? So, what do you drink at the cafe? Cafe de o cha o nomimas. I drink tea. So, nani o nomimasu ka is asking, what do you drink? We can also ask someone where they go. So, in a normal sentence, we have like, Takeshi san wa toshokan ni ikimasu. Takeshi san goes to the library. If I want to ask where Takeshi san goes, I'll have to replace toshokan with a question word. What question word do I use to mean where? That's right, I use doko. So when I want to ask where someone goes to, I can use the topic wa doko ni ikimasu ka? Or doko e ikimasu ka? So doko is my question word, and the sentence needs to end with ka. Takeshi san wa doko ni ikimasu ka? And I can answer by filling in the blank with toshokan. Takeshi san wa toshokan ni ikimasu. It'll work the same way if I want to ask questions about where someone does something at. So if I want to ask about the location. So in a normal sentence, we have topic wa, location de, Object o and then the verb. So for instance, Mary san wa uchi de ongaku o kikimasu. Now, if I want to ask where Mary san listens to music, I want to use again my question word. What question word do we have that means where? That's right, we have doko. So, smiley san wa doko de. Something o and then the verb. So, Mary san wa doko de ongaku o kikimasu ka is our particle at the end. Mary san wa doko de ongaku o kikimasu ka? Then we can answer by replacing the doko with the place. So, Mary san wa uchi de ongaku o kikimasu. Lastly, when we want to ask about the time that someone does something. So we already have a question word that means what time. We have nanji. So nanji goes with the particle ni. Nanji ni. So in whatever place we would have put the time normally, we're instead going to put this nanji ni. So nanji ni. Daigaku ni kimasu ka? At what time do you come to the university? Kuji ni kimasu. Mai nichi, nanji ni okimasu ka? What time do you wake up every day? Shichiji ni okimasu ka? So that's what you need to know for how to make sentences、um, that are asking questions with our new verbs.